patients have been entreated to caution students against picketing after completing school. Deputy Minister of Health Tinana Ayele Mensah says picketing by trained nurses is a major challenge to the ministry as they can only employ nurses when the Minister of Finance gives clearance. Beatrice Pilgara reports. The Deputy Minister Tina Mensah was speaking at the 13th Annual General Meeting of the Conference of Heads of Health Training Institutions in Kumasi. The conference was inaugurated in November 2006 with a membership of 60. The membership has risen to 86, comprising heads of public and private health training institutions. Tina Mensah, described as challenging the frequent picketing by nurses after their training and urged heads of health training institutions to admonish their trainees to be patient. Although the Ministry of Health will keep on to post people whenever we have clearances, we will also urge various heads that uh, when these students, you admit them, please point out to them that they are not born dead. So that being, having that at the back of their mind, when they finish, you have the patience. President of COHET, Monica Nkoma, says the institutions are under-resourced, impeding their capacity to meet most of the requirements by the National Accreditation Board. The government of Ghana's grants to the health training institutions in the area of administrative expenses and stationary contract printing, fuel, and teaching and learning materials, as well as some immediate needs have ceased. Koheti is appealing to the government to increase support to the colleges to enable us meet our academic and physical infrastructural needs. Dean of the School of Nursing and Midwifery at the University of Ghana described the healthcare field as highly stressed. The field of healthcare is known for high level of stress and burnout. So the way you would experience stress is not a one size fits it all. And therefore it is important for all of us here to assess ourselves, to see early signs of stress in our individual lives and go beyond our, go into our reserves to see how best we can deal with it.